Hello, good morning children. Today we are going to do a new lesson hmm? of your honeycomb. Page number 55 and 56 I will explain you today. All of you open page 55. Hmm? See, this is a story about an honest and a hard working old couple and their pet dog. Okay, couple means husband and wife. And their dog. The neighbors are troublesome. Neighbors are not good. They are troubling. Hmm? And the dog dies a sad death. And poor dog dies. The spirit of the dog gives solace. Solace means peace, shanti. And support to his master in unexpected ways. The ashes that made trees bloom. Hmm? In the good olden days of the Daniels. There lived an old couple. Keep your fingers all of you children. Second line. Then third. Huh? When I read, you have to read with me. Whose only pet was a little dog. Having no children. Now this couple had no children. They loved it as though it were a baby. They loved the dog as if it was their baby, their child. The old dam made it. A cushion of blue crap, nice clothes, they made a cushion for him to sit. And at meal time, Muko, the name of the dog was Muko, for that was its name, would sit on it as snug as any cat. Snug means very comfortable, nicely will sit there. The kind people fed the pet with teeth bits of fish. They used to give him fish from their own chopsticks. From their own food they will give the dog and all the boiled rice it wanted. As much as rice, it wanted rice, it like chokha, hmm? chawal. Thus treated the dumb creature, loved its protectors like a being with a soul. Even the dumb creature, dumb means he cannot speak. Animals can't speak, no? So dumb creature loved the Couple, they are protectors. That means they were looking after him, protecting him. He loved them like as if he was a, their son. The old man being a rice farmer, he was a rice farmer, rice couple, went daily with bow or stead into the fields, fields majai, chikodwa, working hard from morning until o dento sama. O dento sama means as the sun is called. Till the sun had gone down behind the hills. Every day the dog followed him to work. Never once turn your pages to run. Harming the white heroine that walked in the footsteps of the old man to pick up the worms. Even the dog used to go with them. And if he saw any birds, heroine who used to come in the field, the dog will not harm them. Kai nuksan na okay? For the old fellow was patient and kind to everything that had life and often turned up a sword on purpose to give food to the birds. Purposely he will dig. Why? Then there will be worms inside. So the birds can eat. One day the dog came running to him. One day the dog came running to his master, putting his paws against his leg. With his pose in the bhakti amam, he is moving and motioning with his head to some spot behind and looking back. He come with me. The old man at first thought his pet was only playing. He thought, oh, the dog is just playing with me and did not mind it. But the dog kept on whining and running to and fro. He is running there and here, there and here and making noises. Hmm? Uh, for some minutes. Then the old man followed the dog a few yards to a place where the animal began a lively scratching. The dog took him somewhere started scratching thinking it was possibly a buried bone or a fish, bit of fish. Hmm? The old man struck his hoe in the earth. He took his hoe and struck it in the and when lo, a pile of gold gleamed before him. And what was there? 
पाइल ऑफ गोल्ड गोल्ड तो क्या सो मच गोल्ड ओके पेज फिफ्टी सिक्स ओवर एंड नेक्स्ट आई विल गिव यू इन वीडियो टू ओके चिल्ड्रन दस इन एन आर द ओल्ड कपल वर मेड रिच नाउ दे फाउंड लॉट ऑफ गोल्ड सो दे बिकेम वेरी रिच द गुड सॉल्स गुड सॉल्स मीन्स बहुत बहुत हसबेंड एंड वाइफ वर वेरी गुड सॉल्स मीन बाई हार्ट बॉट अ पीस ऑफ लैंड दे बॉट लैंड जमीन ली थी मेड अ फीस्ट फॉर देर फ्रेंड्स एंड गेव अ पार्टी टू देर फ्रेंड्स फीस्ट कर दो एंड गेव प्लेंटी फुली टू देर पोअर नेबर्स and even to their neighbors who were poor they gave lots of things as for the dog they petted him till they nearly smothered him with kindness so much that petting gave him the swans that he likes of the dog ha etlo bodu now in the same village there lived a wicked old man and his wife wicked cruel not good not a bit sensitive a color not sensitive no and they were not kind who had always kicked and scolded all dogs whenever any passed their house anybody any dog passed they'll pick up stones and they'll beat the dogs bad people hearing of their neighbors good luck they coaxed the dog into their garden they forced purposely they took the dog in their garden now and set before him bits of fish and other dainties tasty tasty food they are giving the dog Hoping he would find treasure for them, they thought this dog will find treasure for us. This is page number one fifty-seven. Continue, okay? So they, the, these people are wicked. They are thinking, oh, he will show us, or so. I am not even telling you the treasure. But the dog, being afraid of cruel bear. He is afraid of them. Who neither eat nor who. He will not eat only. Hmm? <coughs> Then they dragged him out of doors, and taking a spade and hoe with them, spade and hoe. By force they took the dog with them. Hmm? No sooner had the dog got near a pine tree, there was a pine tree, pineapple tree, right? Pine, pine, growing in the garden. Then he began to paw and scratch the ground. He started scratching. As if a mighty treasure lay beneath him, as if <clears throat> the lot of gold is there. Quick, wife, hand me the spade and go. Go! cried the greedy old fool, that greedy neighbor. <coughs> as he danced with joy, he started dancing with joy. Then the covetous old fellow, who greedy, covetous means greedy, with a spade and the old crown with the hoe began to dig, but there was nothing. There was no gold. But a dead kitten, a grandu, baby kitten, cat's baby was there. She died. The smell of which made them drop their tools and shut their noses. And it was stinking, so they shut their noses. Okay. Furious at the dog. Now they are angry at the dog. The old man kicked and beat him to death. So much they beat the dog that the dog died. So bad people. And the old woman finished the work by nearly chopping off his head with the sharp hoe, and she to beat him so much as if his head also they cut off. Then they flung him into the hole and heaped the earth over his carcass. On his dead body they put lot of sand soil. The owner of the dog heard of the death of his pet and mourning for him, mourning his crying, as if he had been his own child. Went at night under the pine tree. He went under the pine tree to see where his dog was. The good owner. Okay. Chalo next. Now in next video, huh?